a little UK village appears to have been frozen in time with holidaymakers feeling like they've stepped way back into the past when visiting. Featuring in a number of TV shows, the village of Downham has been owned by the Aston family since the 16th century. Situated in the Ribble Valley district of Lancashire, the location seems to shun all visible modern signs of life. For example, when visiting you will not spot any TV aerials or road signs, with all the electricity cables hidden beneath the village roads. With a real historic charm, the beautiful village has cobbled streets and rural countryside views, making it the perfect spot for television dramas over the years, including spooky thriller The Secret of Crickley Hall, starring Sir Anne Jones. Scenes of the BBC drama were filmed in the village pub, The Aston Arms, with 1961 film Whistle Down the Wind shot in the ice cream parlor, which now sells memorabilia linked to the movie. Born and Bred was also shot in the little village, as writes Manchester Evening News. Hailed for its beauty, the village has been owned by the same family for 500 years, with the Asshettons responsible for the upkeep of Downham as its surrounding estate. While none of the buildings are privately owned, the family rents local cottages to people who want to be part of the local community. The spot is also popular with tourists, with visitors now heading there after seeing clips of the village on social media. TikToker Sandy, who runs the account Sandy Make a Sense, recently posted a video about her trip to the Frozen in Time village, saying, This region is home to a sleepy village frozen in time as there are no road signs or TV satellites anywhere to be found. It is also home to many mystical places, such as the Eerie Pindle Sculpture Trail, the Haunted Somsbury Hall or the Harry Potter-esque bookshop Halewood and Sons. The TikToker wandered through the streets of the village, capturing the stone cottages as well as shots of a narrow stream and stone bridge. The video has racked up more than 250,000 views, with locals pleased about the village as coverage. Despite looking as if it is stuck in the past, a spokesperson for the Aston family previously said the village has one foot firmly in the present, and one eye on the future. Local mum of two Michelle Brown, who runs the ice cream shop, said, It's so unspoilt here, there's not many villages like this. If you took all the cars away you'd half expect to see a horse and trap on the streets. It's just a lovely little village and we get lots of visitors here who say it's so beautiful, yet you've got a bustling town like Clitheroe less than 10 minutes away. There are a number of tourist attractions in the village as well as the surrounding areas, such as the village's church tower, which is an example of 15th century architecture as well as walking routes such as the Downham Circular Walk and Chatburn Circular Walk. Back in 1610, Downham was associated with the Pendle Witch Trials, which is considered to be one of the most notorious in the UK due to how well documented it was. During the trial, ten women were hanged for a series of murders across the area, with one of these women Alice Nutter. Alice was said to have been hiding away in Downham's old hall while she awaited trial. Those visiting the area should make a point of taking the Pindle Sculpture Trail. This could be found in the Aitken, just a short drive away from the village. Tourists can walk through the woodland, where they all spot stone witches and mythical sculptures. The trail had good reviews on TripAdvisor too. One person wrote, a great location in the woods, with easy paths to follow and great sculptures. While another added, in a wonderful setting, the sculpture trail is a great way to spend an hour or two. Nestled inside a wonderful forest alongside a reservoir, the sculptures were both weird, wonderful, and poignant. 
don't miss the latest news from around Scotland and beyond. Sign up to our daily newsletter The trial can be taken for free, but it should be noted that it can take hours to walk. Other popular attractions include the Hatchbrook Waterfall and the Brins Colwoods as well as lots nice little spots for food and drink. Those visiting can even opt to spend the night, booking a room in the Aston Arms, 